So we're going to Winterberg and we're going to be riding some cool trails and stuff and doing this whip off thing. I don't really have a clue to be honest. And you're supposed and to be doing a downhill race. Yeah, and we're doing some downhill race. So I'm not really sure what's, what's, what it's going to be like, but it should be good and it should be awesome. So let's get to it. We're walking the race run track. With the specialised crew. Boom. What are you thinking first part of the track? I don't know. Uh, I think just ride it and ride it and see what happens. So we walked, what were we, two thirds of the way down? Roughly, yeah. Yeah, and we come across some sick stuff, but well, this one's well good because it's like you come bombing down, you just like lean it through with this mulch mulchy like leafy stuff which i'm used to because i ride a secret special place that i can't tell anyone <laughs> called sorry games <laughs> no one will know no the way it's hidden and it's in the it's up north somewhere yes. uh, yeah, Uh, we just queued up for practice and yeah, which is probably quite good for the track because yesterday was really dusty. So I haven't done a run yet, but I'm going to see what the track's like. So how was the first run down? Yeah, it was sick. Uh, a bit muddy. Uh, you couldn't see a thing because all the raindrops go on your goggles. And my dad's just changing my roll, on my roll off. So. And that, so I'm, I'm just going to do a GoPro running in a bit um, and I uh, haven't got any goggles on so I want to see what that's like. It might be better, it might be worse, but I'm going to find out. just done a run we gopro'd it um loads of people are dropping down crashing in front of you yeah it's because i'm used to the wet i think you think so i think in my brain how yeah. i think apparently we've been told that apparently a lot of the kids around here aren't used to the rain the rain so yeah and this light like, changes it goes from like rocking to like, and then into like pure dirt and stuff so you think sorry the tracks? Hills. So you think the tracks actually yeah, quite fun? Track. It feels like uh, sorry hills. They just leave. I reckon won't be long until the ruts start to form. Because at the moment, cause the track what they've done, they like cut off. Like they have normal, all the normal tracks, they have big berms and stuff, and then they cut off. They have like grass areas, and that the moment's just grass and a bit of loam. But I can in a bit create some deep ruts.
your seeding run and it looks like you're about 14 seconds quicker than second place. Something like that, but you were quite far ahead. Yeah. Um, and you caught up with the kitty ahead. Yeah. But he didn't slow me down because he was like right on the finish line. Then I was like right touching his back wheel. But it was fun that one. Who? Harry. What's down there? This is the wood part. And you, you're already in the finals. We went down there earlier, but you had to pay to watch, and we yeah. didn't know that it was actually the qualification. But I want to run. Yeah, but you got your finals in a minute. It's your fault. Okay. Oh shit. Harry, that was sick. You got three seconds off your seeding time. How do you feel? Mm. Winner. I don't know, just, I just like being here and riding. It's like, it's like riding. Not about the wind, it's about the riding. Fair oh, enough. There, look. See, you know I told you about that picture? You see that sign down there? Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Right. no pooing in the bush. Okay, we'll have a little look at that in a minute. It looks quite funny. I was like, who would poo in a bush? I mean, oh. I know I would, but like, I wouldn't do it in the middle of there. <laughs> Die schnellsten Boys U13 und der Mann in der Fasttagesbestzeit, obwohl er so 13 fährt mit 208, Harrison Schöpfel! Mechanic extraordinaire. Yeah. Harry's no, bike has never been so good. What was your time? 